<laughs> Don't give me that. You like my tent in the background, by the way? Yeah, that's nice. I don't where you sleep. All right. Are we recording? Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> All right, cool. Welcome, everybody. Brad Pringer here, a leader partnerships team at InfoTrust. We're excited to announce our brand new resource guide for GA4, Google Analytics 4. A lot of you probably watching this have universal analytics. Google is completely transforming the future of analytics and moving to Google Analytics 4. And we have an entire resource guide with webinars, how, how to tag videos, um, compliant tracking guides, a whole list of resources. And I'm here with my colleague, Amin. Um, he's gonna talk a little bit more about some of these key updates of Google's huge transformation in the future of analytics. So Amin, uh, let me pass it to you and talk about really the future of analytics and why Google is building a platform that has built to scale. Sure, thank you, Brad. We're really excited about GA4. There's lots of key value points I wanna talk through, at least four of them uh, in this quick video uh, and why we're really excited and really why we're pushing all of our partners to go ahead and dual tag now. So one, a lot more flexibility with GA4 over Universal Analytics between the white space reporting capabilities and the analysis hub. Um, the event model in itself is a lot more powerful it will allow a lot more processing by Google, which means less sampled reports, faster reporting UI, just more free will in, in GA to build your own reports with new reports that have been a common ask like user pathing, trend exploration, lots of great reporting uh, for those analysts out there built on a really robust platform. So that's number one, more flexibility and customization with reporting. Number two, because of this model and because the scalability that Google's building into GA4, there's a lot more intelligence capabilities, meaning machine learning right in the UI. Uh, customer lifetime value metrics, predictive metrics, anomaly detection, all these things that Google with its vast resources can provide for you automatically, it'll be built right into GA4 with this new uh, measurement platform and event model. Number three, and you probably heard this, um, it's privacy focus, privacy first. Uh, the whole model is meant to be around event-based tracking from a data collection, but also centered around users. What this actually means is that Google can now build in new features that address the consent model data loss problem um, through modeling. So there's some new features being rolled out here. We can't talk about a lot of them today, but just know that GA4, the focus is there from Google to build out these privacy focused capabilities. Um, Lastly, the, the fourth key value here is that it's easy to get started. We recommend dual tagging. If you have a tag management system, at least adding the page view event and some auto events, start now, get some data collection, get access to all that cool things I just mentioned with user pathing and the anom anomaly detection, et cetera. Um, and you can start building your year over year data set side by side universal um, as you kind of roll out your extended event tracking. So starting today is super easy, lots of value that comes with it. Uh, back to you, Brad. Thanks, Amin. So just have to say, we understand that this is overwhelming for a lot of you, uh, you know, migrating your entire organization from training or, you know, training folks in the organization to understanding the differences. We're going to have a whole list of resources coming your way in addition to everything you see on our site today. So thank you. Please reach out of how we can help educate, help train, help you build a plan for your organization. And we're excited to you know, head into this new future of analytics and drive more value and efficiency across your organization. Thanks everyone. Mm -hmm.